Want more coins to boost your team? Need that new card? MMO EXP. Cheapest and most reliable coins on the internet. Use code SCOMO for 5% off. Yay! Yo, what's going on, guys? We are back. Zero chill, boys. There is so much to do, man. I am so excited. If you are excited, man, let me know. There is just absolutely so much stuff to do. I am, I am unbelievably hyped, boys. Drop a like if, if you are ready for the abundant amount of stupid shit we are about to do with this promo, boys. I'm so excited. The only bad news that I can really see out of this so far is the name of the currency. It's not snow, so I can't be snowmo once again. It's going to be kindling. And I mean, that, that is going to start kindling, killing, killing, killing. I can just, I can see it already. It's going to be, it's going to be a ton of fun just saying that nine million times for the next three weeks. This is going to be the first part of either two or three parts. The Zero Chill promo is going to go on for three weeks, guys. I'm going to be running a bunch of stuff in the background, and basically this is everything from the stream, and this is just the first part. Big things so far first. We have a 95 overall Bruce Matthews. There is going to be zero chill cards everywhere from an 81 all the way up to 93. There's going to be like gingerbread guys that we are going to be able to get from playing house rules. Yes, there is going to be house rules that is going to be changing every Monday. So we're going to get three different sets of house rules with, with wins that are going to be able to extend over the entire time. So they're all going to stack and everything like that. There is so much content. 94 overall Christian McCaffrey, 93 overall Derwin James, 92 overall Darius Leonard, bro. There is just so many cards. You're going to need those three zero chill guys that is going to go into the zero chill Bruce Matthews set, which is going to give you the 95 overall Bruce Matthews, man. There, there, there is so much stuff, dude. This is crazy. There are so many sets that are just blacked out that we can't even see. I, there, there's like four or five sets that you can't even see that are on the front page of the set. We are going to have so many solos to play. The solos are just going to keep on going. We're going to need like 400 and something stars over the time to be able to go through all of these solos. Zero chill solos are going to give us kindling. They're going to give us hearth events. The hearth events are going to give us like players they're going to give us gifts there is presence 100 in the game you can play the game to earn a smaller presence you can quick sell presence to get you more kindling you can use the kindling to get players you can use the kindling to get bigger presence there's all kinds of stuff going on but there is going to be these hearth packs that is going to be within the hearth house rules challenge events bro there, there there's a deep freeze a deep frost like there looked like there was so many different solos and different things to be able to play. It's crazy. On top of the hearth packs that you get from playing head to head. And I don't know if that's exactly going to be like the last time. Because you remember we had ways to be able to get these guys. But like the cards were like so rare to be able to get like the speed ability. Like they, they never happened. It was just like 20, 20, 20 currency every time. Like, depending on how good these are, that could be something good. But there is going to be three head-to-head -head house rules masters that you're going to be able to get. These guys are called gingerbread men that you need gingerbread collectibles. There's an Adrian Peterson, there is an Amari Cooper, and there is a Ted Hendricks. These guys already have abilities and super uh, factor, super factors, X factors already ready to go. They are, they're kind of like the superstars that we had that already had the abilities and chemistries and stuff like that on them. These are going to have them too. So I'm not sure. We just play the game, play the her stuff, be able to earn the gingerbread stuff to then, you know, keep on earning the guys. The limited edition, basically house rules solo event, which last time was limited this time it's not gonna be limited so apparently over the seven days you're just able to play it as many times as you want to keep on earning a chance i guess at either a zero chill hearth pack a gingerbread man collectible or like different stuff that you can get within that pack which is going to be i guess more kindling or i don't bro there's so much stuff we are going to be able to get a team captain token so we are going to be able to upgrade shazier it's going to be like one of the first things after a few solos, I think it's like 10 stars. You're going to be able to get uh, enough stars within the zero chill solos to be able to get a team captain token. Bro, I, 
Kralo was talking for like 45 minutes non-stop and I don't think he ever repeated himself. It was all just information. They're going to be releasing more and more solos and you're going to get stuff in this tier just like all the other rewards and stuff like that. You're going to get gingerbread collectibles at 120 stars, 180 stars. You're going to get more kindling at 150 stars. Uh, there's all kinds of stuff. Make sure you check back every day because the hearth stuff is going to be able to update. The snow day packs, the zero chill stuff, all those solos are going to just keep on updating. They're going to just keep on putting content in the game every few days. I would stay on top of it. Like, you're going to have to keep on checking in. Check in every day, play a few games, get the kindling and stuff that they give you. There's going to be a lot of free cards and things to grind. The first things that I would really, really do is just stay on top of the solos. Knock out all the solos. If you aren't like, you're just too overwhelmed right there, just go into the first one, go into the zero chill solos and knock out all those solos. If you want to play head to head, start grinding those head to head events. Get, hopefully you can get some kindling and be able to stack those gingerbread guys and things like that. I don't know if you can get enough kindling from playing you maybe then can get enough kindling to get the players from the stores and then be able to get like Bruce Matthews from just grinding. I don't, I mean, it's gonna, it's gonna be a lot of grinding, but go out and just, it, it's not a secret. What to do first, just turn the game on and play the solos, play the head ahead. We got, we got house rules and we got solos that are gonna be updating every day. So there's gonna be plenty of things to do. The store, the store definitely looks like there is going to be a method. So. I would stay and make sure that you watch my stream, watch my video, stay on top of CC's video. There's going to be a way for us to be able to make a lot of coins. I'm sure of it. The 93 overall Ted Hendricks, he doesn't look bad. I mean, he already has all the abilities and stuff like that on there, but he's 84 speed. You can power him up. You are going to be able to put like everything on him. So I think if you power him up, you can change what abilities and stuff on there, or you can just keep him exactly the way he is. But 84 speed, 91 block shedding. I, dude, some of these guys like Willie and stuff like that, they play really good. Ted Hendricks could be really good to help you stop the run. There is going to be holiday puzzle sets. There's sets, there's store packs, there's, bro. And this is not even all the content. There's going to be so much content, but there is going to be holiday set packs and holiday set sets. There's too much stuff. There's a set where we're going to be able to get gifts. It's either going to give us... And bro, there's so much stupid stuff we're going to be able to do in tomorrow's stream. But we're going to be able to get gifts from this too. And then if you have duplicate puzzle pieces, you really can't trade them. But there's going to be an exchange set. So you're going to be able to exchange the puzzle pieces to be able to do a set to be able to get more gifts. This is going to be pretty cool because you're going to have a chance to be able to get a medium or a large. So we're going to have to roll a lot of these things to see if we can get some of the large gifts. Store is going to be loaded with zero chill packs, zero chill bundles, 85 overall zero chill player that you can get with 150 points just like every other promo. There is going to be a zero chill bundle that is going to have 10 zero chill packs and two, two toppers, 85 plus. I really like that they gave it and it's only 5,800 points on that one. I don't know if there's going to be like a bigger bundle or anything. The other real cool thing is there is two not capped packs that we can do in the store a 78 plus overall zero chill only player so 250 kindling will give us a 78 plus they also said that these could be lowered the amount of kindling per these packs so that 92 94 that's 8,000 something they're saying it's gonna be like 6,000 so we're gonna be able to do the 78 plus pack and an 85 plus pack there's going to be a way for us to be able to roll these things make coins stay on top of all the videos man see what everyone's doing out in the community if you want to know how to make coins it's gonna be right here in this section between like the 85 the 78 and the 92s there's gonna be a way to make coins house rules solos good store we don't know if there's like a training to kindling option or anything like that they really didn't show that they just showed the zero chill section they did say there's more stuff coming during the week he, uh Kralo said that he's super excited about something coming on a Wednesday. My guess is some type of Russell Wilson limited or something like that. There's going to be limited. There's going to be all kinds of fun things. The cool thing I also thought was kind of nice was all the gifts open up at one day. They open up on the 24th, not just different days and stuff. So we're just going to get one big day of all the gifts opening and stuff. 
that should be pretty cool but guys i'm super excited man last year zero chill was absolutely it, it was the most fun all year the streams the videos everything was absolutely insane man if you're excited drop a like let me know down in the comments let me know what was like if you were around last year what was your favorite zero chill moment last year boys we're gonna be rolling for icebreakers once again boys i can't wait see you tomorrow we out Yay!